Hey guys, my name is Rob Noir, and way back in the day on this channel, I used to have a really cool series called In-Depth Reviews and Comparisons, where I'd take old consoles and show you the best way to play these consoles on your HDTV, in HD, 1080p, 4K, all that good stuff. And I covered a bunch of consoles back in the day. I did the NES, the SNES, the N64, GameCube, Wii, Atari 2600, and finally, after months and months of you guys begging me and begging me to bring this series back, here it is. Finally, we're doing another video. And today, my friends, we're doing a very special video. This time, it's all about consoles in SD. Yeah, that's right. Old school, 140p, 360p, 480p, 480i, you know, that really low baseline resolution. But what if you want to take a new console and hook it up to like an older television? Well, how do you do that? That's what I'm here for. What you got to do is actually super simple. You got to get an HDMI to AV converter that will convert your HDMI signal to an AV out, audio video out. Now again, this is super simple. It's not complicated at all. You got to make sure you don't get an AV to HDMI converter because that will not work. They only work one way, but you need an HDMI to AV converter. Again, super simple, super not complicated. I'm sure you Followed all of that. Okay, so you got this converter, so what do you do? Well, it's really, really easy, but let me walk you through it. I'm gonna be using an Xbox One because, you know, that's the most popular console. That's what everybody in the world has, right? So let's make this baseline, borderline easy for everyone. Boot up your Xbox, plug in an HDMI cable into the HDMI out of your console like you would normally do, but don't, don't hook that up to an HDMI television. No, 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 sir. Now take the other end of that HDMI cable and shove it into the converter here. So what you gotta do here is you gotta grab these cables and make sure they're composite. You want it to be the lowest quality signal you can. If you can do RF, do RF. I'm not going to because you know what? Screw RF. But if you can do it, do it. So grab these cables and what you want to do is plug them into your CRT like I'm going to show you here. Crap. I don't own a CRT. Nobody online owns a CRT. We're not friggin' 80 years old. What am I going to do? If only there was someone I could turn to for help. Screw off, Doug. I know, Dave! Do you remember Dave? He was in my Atari 2600 video about playing it in HD. He loves old crap like that. Maybe he knows where to get a CRT. Hey, Rob. How's it going? Hey, Dave. I was having a little bit of a problem that I was hoping you could maybe help me with. Mm, well, shoot. Uh, I, I don't know what I can do for you, but you gotta tell me what you need. I'm looking for an old CRT television. CRT, hmm, uh, for a computer, or are you looking for something specifically different? I pretty much just need anything with a video input. Um, so you need something with an RCA then? I don't have one exactly in stock that's like that. I have old computer screens. I might know somebody that can uh, help you out. Let me just give him a call and uh, I can let you know. Sounds good. So hopefully he'll get back to me soon and then... Ah, you are the one that's looking for a CRT. Uh, yeah? Who are you? Dave contacted me. Excellent choice. Excellent choice. I'll be there. I'll be there. Would you like me to set it up for you? No! Too late, bitch, I'm here. You know what, all in all, it actually looks not too bad. Not as bad as I was hoping anyways. So we gotta do more. We really gotta go the distance here, guys. We gotta add more. So what we're actually gonna do here is take those composite cores and run them to a composite to HDMI upscaler. And then we're gonna run that HDMI cable to another AV converter. This way we have three layers of stuff in between our console and the TV. The input lag is gonna be marvelous. I think you should play Doom. I think you should play Shovel Knight. Boom. Shovel Knight wins. So in the end, yeah, pretty much got what we're looking for. What do you think, pile of junk? Huh? 
Oh well. How about you? What do you think, Cthulhu? Alright guys, so that pretty much wraps up this video on consoles and standard definition. Very, you know, cutting edge, new technology. We all gotta make sure we're on top of it and able to handle this when it becomes the standard. So hopefully this video has given you all the information that you'll need to be able to do that. Of course, if you have any questions, you can leave them down in the comments below. I feel like I really covered everything and explained everything extremely clearly. So it's probably not necessary, but if you want to do that, put it down there. Anyways guys, I hope you enjoyed. Hope you smash that bell, click that like button button, subscribe, and as always, I will see you in the next video. Hey, thanks a lot for making it all the way to the end of the video. This is a lot different than the kind of videos I usually make, but it was a lot of fun, so if you guys like this, I can definitely do more in the future. Special shout out to my guests Dave, Phil, Pile of Junk, and our Lord and Savior Cthulhu. Alright guys, take care.